It's been a little bit since we were filming last. Um, during that time, I have been relentlessly coating these armor pieces in glue. As you can see, I already did cut out this piece and glue it on there. Originally, I was going to just paint it on, but I thought I wanted a little bit more of a 3D effect on it. Um, they're pretty hard now. This is about 20 or 30 coats of glue. Um, takes a long time. It's the most painful, longest, most horrifying step of the process. But now we get to paint, so let's get on that. So before you start painting, what you want to do is create a test piece. Generally do the same thing that you did with all of these and go ahead and lay down your paint how you think you want it. Um, I've done a couple color tests and I did a little bit of playing around with the puffy paint to make designs and such. Um, I like this silver so that's what I've gone ahead and done here. You're going to want two or three layers just depending on the look that you want and the coverage you need over the color. If these ones are green you can still see a little bit through them. Um, on these I'm going to go ahead and do the bolts that are in the armor. I'm going to use the puffy paint for that. So I've got my reference picture here. And keep yours on hand, even if you think you know what the armor looks like. You may end up regretting it if you don't do it exactly how you want it. Thank you. 